guys welcome back to my youtube channel it's tutu bj and i'm back with another hair video in today's video i'm going to be working with hair and beauty and i'm going to start off by doing the bold cap method this company does give you a free wig cap in the box which is really good so you don't have to go out and buy new wig caps especially if you don't have any or if you're running out so you want to make sure you cut the ends first so when you're spraying you've got to be spray on the wig cap on your hairline um it will just make sure it sticks properly and there's no gaps underneath the wig cap and yes now you just see me um spraying this on the wig cap and i'm going to use my finger to basically so it doesn't go down or so it just stays in place i also use some foundation to match my skin and now i'm going to use a scissors so i'm using the small scissors and i'm going to use that to um, cut the excess excess of the wig cap So the wig that I'm using in this video is this deep wave curly wig and it's 24 inches. Um, all the details will be down in the description box below. Um, I'm gonna, I've already applied it, put it on my head. Now I'm gonna style my edges. And this was really easy. I wanted a fluff, really fluffy and quite a lot of edges. This time, if you want you know smaller edges or thinner edges you can do that as well but this is what i wanted today as you know if you watch my videos you know sometimes i want don't want any edges at all and sometimes i do want edges and sometimes i want it like a lot exaggerated and sometimes i don't so yeah to do my edges i use mousse i always use mousse um i'm gonna try and use um the got to be sprayed next time um, because apparently that works really good as well. I think I used to, probably. But, yeah. So, now I've finished doing my edges um, on this side. I'm just... Basically, after that, I go in with the brush. Brush back any hair or any strings of hair that will interfere with the edges. That I've just, you know, took time and do for myself. So, yeah. So, now I'm going to take some silk headband and this will just help for the edges to set a bit and so yeah i am gonna go in with a hair dryer so it just dries a bit more quicker and yeah After I've added some foundation to my lace, I'm now gonna go in with a wax stick. And this makes it easier for me to go back in with my hot comb and um, flatten the wig. And yeah, so doing this before you hot comb, it's really, really important and it really helps.
now it's time to define these curls and i'm using the olive oil mousse um this is this mousse doesn't have any um glue or anything sticky in it so yeah it really helps for you to define the, your curls and yeah i'm also going to go in with um hair serum so any heat protection that you have will help After I'm satisfied with how my hair and how curly the hair is and detangled it, I'm now going to use the hair dryer to dry the hair and the curls and so it's fluffy and it just looks amazing and not too wet. And yeah, this is the finishing look. I hope you guys enjoyed and I will see you guys in my next video. Make sure you subscribe, like, share and yeah, bye.